Hey guys, welcome back. This is Goddess Nicole Tarot, back to bring you another energetic read for the collective, for my beautiful and handsome soul tribe members. Welcome guys. It's nice to see you guys again. It's nice to read for you guys again. I hope all is well. I hope your overall health is doing good. With that being said, <laughs> mental, spiritual, emotional, all of that. Okay. I hope your well-being is fine. Okay. <laughs> With that being said, thank you for the continuous support that you show me in the channel. It is greatly appreciated, guys. It does not go unnoticed. I love each and every one of you guys. Even the enemies that watch me. Okay. With that being said, um... <clears throat> I can be loud on this channel. I also can cry on this channel. I also can use profanity from time to time. It all depends on what energies I pick up on, what energies I embody, the channel messages, the channel songs, the downloads, what I pick from the cards. It all plays a part over here when we're getting the messages out there clear and concisely and truthful to you guys. Okay? As quickly as I can. If you're new here, welcome to the Soul Tribe. We would love to have you. If you have not subscribed to the channel and you just stopping by, thank you. Thank you. That means you find me interested as a reader, okay? Go ahead and press that bell notification once you subscribe to the channel and become a part of the Soul Tribe. We want to grow and glow, grow and grow over here, flourish each and every time we assign a member. So welcome to the Soul Tribe, guys, if you're new here, okay? We would love to have you, okay? With that being said, guys... I was uh, picking up some energy when I was in the shower. Um, I was getting don't trust that, okay? Something you may have been pondering on, thinking about, contemplating about, don't trust it, okay? Or don't trust a person, okay? Because I, def I just feel like there's some wishy-washy energy, okay? Some uh, topsy-turvy energy some uh back and forth energy indecision okay a lot of decision making a lot of choices okay i was picking up on that energy don't trust it or don't trust this person okay the way things have been going during these mercury retrogrades planets being in retrograde the recent super moon and the full moon it's just a I, I just wouldn't trust a lot of things collective, okay? I'm going to just be real with you. I'm going to be frank with you. And I'm going to be honest and afford with you, you know? You know, I don't like to sugarcoat anything with you guys, you know? Excuse me, I was fixing the uh, camera. I mean the phone. But anyway, I was just getting the numbers 222, 2222. I was getting um, 1313. 2020 so something is clear to you okay look up those uh numbers they could be very significant here to you i just wouldn't trust the collective okay or somebody is trying to make you not trust something too i did get that as well or this is the person that's trying to make you not trust something you cannot trust this person okay or these people okay whatever it is I don't think you should trust it, collective. Go with your own mind. Go with your own discernment. Use your intuition. Let the spirits and the most high guide you, okay? Your ancestors and the angels here. Yeah, because somebody is out for self. This is what somebody's out for. Something has shifted here. And it's not good in this person's or these people's favor, okay? Something about your fortune here. Somebody wants a piece of your luck, your success. Okay. Your destiny here. Maybe these people um, felt like they could switch something out with you or change something up for you. Don't trust what they say. That's what I'm hearing. I'm hearing when it all falls down, something here done fell. Okay. It's something these people have fell flat on their face or flat on their tail or something they was doing here has fell flat. Okay? Something here when it pertains to your destiny here. Yeah, it's protected. I can't make it up. Come through spirit. It's protected. It's protected, man. And you stood up for yourself here. You accepted the challenge. And I just feel like whatever position you're in now, you're fortunate to have this. It's faded. 
and it's protected. Seven of Wands speaks of uh, courage, protectiveness, self-expression. You could be expressing yourself, okay? Hey, this is not yours. This is mine. And I'm going to stand on business when it pertains to mine. Okay, I'm going to protect mine at any cost. That's how some of you guys are feeling. Whether this is your children, your stability, your money, your home, it's protected by the Most High. Some of you guys are connected. This is fated to be, for you guys to have long-term protection here, around-the-clock protection, okay? Because I feel like somebody was trying to take this here, and somebody tested your gangster or tested your ancestors or your angels here, and maybe they found out real quick because something shifted for them. Yeah, they found out real quick. Yeah, a King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Don't trust this person. Come through spirit with the confirmation. Don't touch, don't trust this person. This is, it doesn't have to be a Scorpio or a Cancer or a Pisces in this situation. It could be anybody collective. You know, take the, take the signs, however it resonate to fit your situation. Okay, eat the meat and spit out the bones. I'm trying to keep now this this net hasn't been in here. It just it, it just came in here when I started my reading. So you could have mundering spirits, hovering spirits around you because you're getting this success and this fortune. But it's protected here from this person, this job turkey here. Somebody who is a manipulator, a liar here. The king of cups in the reverse? Absolutely manipulative. Okay? This is somebody who is deceitful. They're a liar. Okay? They could be very, very defensive, frustrated right now. They could be feeling insecure, a lack of motivation. Um, this person could be bad-mouthing somebody. Okay? This is somebody that uses their intuition for dark here. Okay? This definitely could be a warlock. <clears throat> their heart chakra is blocked off too as well. They're unaligned. This person could be acting out of their root and sacral and solar plexus chakra all the time. The rest of them are off. This person don't have any love for nobody. So much more about this king of cups here. Yeah, this person trying to block you. Or they, there's somebody he's trying to block. Something for you. Don't trust this person when they come in. You can probably have two suitors here. Two chances here. Two opportunities here. Two male figures here, okay? We got the King of Pentacles and the King of Cups in the reverse. Or this person is shape shifting. What about this King of Pentacles here? Who is he? Yeah, he's coming in too. So you got two suitors coming in. This is what it's giving me too as well. One of them you cannot trust. The other one you can. This King of Pentacles you can. Somebody can definitely have water in their chart. Somebody could be a cancer here. This king of cups could be a cancer. I just feel like somebody wants your, wants the victory at all costs here with the chariot. This is probably trouble. Somebody wants redemption, okay? This, this king of cups is trouble. Somebody wants to fight, or this is somebody that's trying to stop your counterpart here, this king of pentacles, from coming in. They feel like they've been defeated here. And now they want to start a fight or a dispute or a disruption or something here. But it's protected. What is this chariot here? Yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. A lot of confusion. Don't trust this. Don't trust this king of cups. Whoever's in this energy here. I just feel like it's going to be a lot of confusion here when this... Um, when this love offer come in, because it, it could be two people. And you're going to have to make a decision here. You may be confused. Because you have several, several options here. Several options here. Okay? Why the Seven of Cups to the uh, Knight of Cups here, Spirit? Let us know. Yeah, offer. I can't make it up. Somebody really loves you, and there's another person that doesn't. Somebody's out for selfish gain, selfish reason. It's a lot of emotions here, okay? Somebody wants you to be confused about who is your partner here, who are you supposed to be with. This manipulator here is coming in with this offer. That's what I think. Yeah, this one right here is going to make you happy. This king of pentacles. 
it's giving me divine masculine energy. This is giving me karmic masculine. Okay? They both coming in with the chariot. And they want to be successful with you here. They want a victory here. Somebody is very presumptuous. Okay? If if that is a word. They're, they're presuming. Uh, they're assuming or and, and um, they have a presumption about how this is going to go. Somebody is trying to block out your competition here. Somebody is competing against your divine master. This is what it's giving me too. Don't trust this person. Don't trust it. <laughs> yeah. This person from your past is this, this king of cups. Pisces, Cancer, more Scorpio. Somebody could have heavy water placements here. Heavy water placements. Somebody wants to stop your happiness. They want this king, want you to be confused about this offer. Somebody wants to, somebody don't want you to be happy in a divine union or with your divine counterpart here. Man, it, this is crazy. This is absolutely insane. I just feel like if you couldn't get it right in the past, what makes you think you're going to get it right now? What make what gives you the right to come back? It's not your place anymore. Somebody needs to know their place. But somebody is competing against your counterpart here. This is what it's giving me too. All of that is protected. That's part of your destiny too. That's fated to happen. To, that, that's fated to happen too. Okay? For you to be in a divine union. For you to be happy. For you, some of you guys to start a family. This is contentment. Some of you guys are going to get pregnant here. Because this is a boss. The king of pentacles in, in the upright is financially stable. Prosperous. This is prosperity. This person is a leader. They're determined to make you happy. To satisfy you. To have a soft and happy life here. Somebody else is determined to not make that happen. Yeah, they holding on to you from the past. Four of Pentacles. Child, get on somewhere. With their sneaky, deceptive ass. They're strongly holding on to you, child. The strength to the Four of Pentacles, they will not let go. But they're coming in being sneaky and deceptive. A liar, a manipulator. They're attempting to come in probably the same time here as your counterpart yeah you're gonna have to keep your boundaries up with this person absolutely yeah because this person is really they're determined here they're they are determined to hold on to your energy too as well it's just like somebody gets the kick out of this they're they want in control this is somebody that thinks they got power over you and they're gonna take this action they're going to continue to hold on to you with the Six of Cups here. This person that you've already released and let go, they're going to continue to hold on to you. And they're going to continue to do spell work over this destined thing that's fated to happen for you. Even though you're protected, it's protected. They're going to continue to do it. And some, for some of you, they're going to pop up on you. Yeah, with the Nine of Cups to the Page of Cups. You're gonna have to have a you're gonna have to have a talk with your ancestors, your angels here. I'm telling you, there's two masculines in your energy here. Yeah, but one of them is dark. And the other one is the right one for you. Okay. I'm telling you, bro. Yeah. You're gonna have to use your discernment. Yeah. You release somebody here. You're gonna have to gain some clarity too. Four cups in the reverse talks about clarity. It talks about um, acceptance. Somebody can accept the fact that you've moved on. And you finna have all of what you... Uh, is fated to come into your life here. For God and the ancestors. For what, what, they, what they want you to have. Somebody else is in deep contemplation. Somebody else is thinking about... A way to come in and destroy this. To have you manipulated here. To have you all in your head here. Off balance. Okay? Being deceitful. A liar. Childish. Insecure. They're trying to stop you. They're trying to delay you. To create uh, illusions here with the Seven of Cups. 
That's what they're trying to do. Whew, this is somebody that could have in the past had you in the options here. Had you in some type of uh, delusion, okay? But you release this person. You're not thinking about them at all. This is somebody that missed the opportunity with you as well to be in a relationship with you. Uh, missed the opportunity to keep you stuck to them or tied to them. You've moved on and, and you finna be happy. With the King of Pentacles coming over the sun, this person is gonna make y'all happy, bro. But you got a crooked ass ex here in the background that's deceitful, they are liar. They are manipulative. They are, they, they are gaslighted. They are, they are cheater. This is somebody that could be emotionally and physically abusive. They can be a pervert here as well. <laughs> very sexual promiscuous here. This King of Cups in the reverse. Could be very violent. So you guys just be mindful, Burr. This person could be very obsessive. Because they got offers here, back to back. But they're small offers. This person is in competition with your divine master. Child, what is this? Yeah, and they're sad about it too. They want you to be sad, not happy too. They're sad that you released their ass. You're not thinking about them. And you move forward here. You could have went through a lot with this person. You, but you try triumphant over everything. That's what the uh, the chariot talks about. Will, the will, the strength, okay, to go through whatever it is here. You went through it. Time after time here. Whatever this negative ass person was doing to you of the past, you went through it, okay? You could have been sad or broken. You could have been upset, full with grief and sorrow, but you got through this shit. The chariot is telling me that. More, more Scorpio energy. Somebody got cans. They got a lot of water placements here. Got a lot of water placements here. Yeah. You came up out of that shit. Nine of swords, bro. In the reverse. You did. It's just like, man, you moved on. Okay. You didn't give up. This was an end of a karmic cycle here. This is exactly what it is. And somebody else don't want to end it out because they don't want to do the motherfucking work. Who problem is that? That ain't got nothing to do with us. This person is sad that you're moving on and you finna go to better things. Jeez. This person didn't know how to communicate right. Very hypersensitive. Hypersexual here too as well. Needy. <laughs> unintelligent. This person is not emotionally mature at all. Immature. Yeah. And they could, this is somebody you could divorce that don't go, uh, they go against society rules here. They could be part of a cult. Okay. Yeah. That you don't want to work with no more. Three of Pentacles. You don't want to work with this person. More Taurus and Capricorn energy here. Because you know they a hoe out here in these streets. Yeah. Empress, I'm talking to you, my love. Yeah. This person wants you to result back to working with them so bad. But you moving forward, it's a no. Whoever this is lingering around, they need to go on somewhere. They need to stay out of your energy and stop feeling sorry for their damn self because they know they done fucked up here. Big time. And there's no coming back from that. You can stay sad and broken all in your feelings over there. Stay over there with that shit. You don't want to be bothered with that. Yeah, I'm telling you. All broken, busted, and disgusted, in hiding, in retreat, in solitude, okay? Withdrawal from the world, isolated, sad. Could be paranoid. Doing a lot of things here because you released their ass and this cycle is really over. You wasn't bullshitting when you said, I'm done, I'm done. Somebody need to realize that and move on. Somebody got some mental issues. What is this five of cups? Yeah. Nine of wands in the reverse. <laughs> Somebody that's... <laughs> Man, I'm telling you stubborn somebody who is stubborn 
and, and, and feel like giving up. They feel trapped because you don't pay them no attention. You don't want to be with them. They all in their head. They feel like, you know, just go ahead and giving it up. They ain't got no other choice here. This is what I'm saying. Because they can't stop anything that's fated to happen for you. They ain't got no other choice. You might as well to pack it up, boo. Pack your feelings up. Take your raggedy ass on up out of this person's energy, this empress energy. Because she got big, bigger and better things to accomplish. And you're not one of those. Yeah. And the secrets is out about this person. You know who they are. It's, it's no surprise to some of you guys because you went through a lot with this person. You did. And they just haven't not released all that. They picked up regression, resentment, lies, deceit. They haven't forgiven themselves here. This is somebody that haven't forgave themselves for doing what they did to you. Having you in your emotions here. This is your karmic ex here. I have the moon and the sun here that betrayed you. That's secretly trying to sabotage you again. But you could know this. Okay? You connected to the divine here, Empress. You know. This uh, this person is out to be a bully. Okay? Because they're going through loss and conflict. They didn't make a decision on you. And that's not your fault. That's cool. You just moved on with your life. And, and you got better. Okay? That's all it is. Somebody just said that you got away. And now they're trying to... Stop what whatever nice is coming in for you. This is a happiness hater. That's all it is. Happiness hater. Yeah, stop trying to stop your good news, man. I'm trying to tell. You, I'm trying to tell you. This is what uh, this is who this person is. They did a lot of injustice things to you, and now they gotta suffer that shit. What goes around comes back around, baby. What goes up must come down. As above, so below. Yeah, this person ain't got nothing coming in. They see, they watching you. They too busy watching you. In this bitter ass attack mode energy. Very mean, hateful. Got a negative spirit on them. This is somebody who's demonic here. Very abusive. And they know they are. And they know they're getting karma for what they did to you. They know that. Stop staying in this person's energy. They are the devil. I can't make it up. Mean and hateful ass person. That sucks, suffers from addictions. That has ties to a cult. That does dark a lot of dark shit to people. And, uh, and, and invests poorly in people. Whatever that may be to them. But they want you unhappy. You're not unhappy. You're not sad. This is this person's energy. Man, take your ass on. Yeah. Being sneaky with this energy. This black magic. Dibble dabbing and, and, and spying and diminishing spying and being sneaky and deceptive in your energy. Like they gonna stop something. They ain't gonna stop a funky ass thing. This is fated for you to happen. For you to move on. The spirit was testing this person. Yeah. Entertainment in the reverse, dishonesty. This person thought it was funny what they were doing. They thought it was a hilarious. Now somebody's not laughing anymore because you didn't think this was funny. When you told this person you was going to move on, you did just that. How you going to be lying and think shit is funny and, and think it's entertainment to hurt someone? That's That's cruel. That is cruel. Devil worship ass nigga. And they just hate that things are coming into your life so positively here. My intentions are pure. I only want to improve your life. And this is what this King of Pentacles is going to do. They're going to make you happy. This person withhold a lot of information from you. We did see the moon. And it's out. It came out in the reverse under the deck. Somebody thought this was so comical. When they was doing this charade to you. Doing all this negative, throwing this negative energy to you. Being a fucking tyrant. Being an instigator. Being a liar. Being inconsistent here. Somebody was doing all of that. Negative energy towards you. And thought that shit was funny. Now that shit is not funny to them no more. Because who, who got that shit right back to them? They have. This is somebody defeated. 
They are defeated and sad. This is somebody pathetic. Yeah, they sabotage you countless of times. And they're trying to do it now. They trying to do it now. They trying to figure out how to come in and confuse you. Yeah, because they ported this coat. You're not going to welcome this person. Welcome is in the reverse. You don't want shit else to do with them. And that's just period. When you walk away, that was the that was the done. That was the camel that broke the straw's back. It was a wrap. It was over. Because you knew this person was trouble. You knew they were unfriendly. You knew they were the son of the devil. They treated you so cold and foul. Somebody did not love you at all. At all. And they want to come back. This person ain't grow up with growth in the reverse. They haven't. Some of you, these people are still a page. Still childish and immature and reckless out here. It'll be a no. Yeah, they want to come in to date you with this offer. I can't make it up. You're going to have to use your discernment on this. You're going to have to. Because this person is closed off. Yeah, and they're controlling. Come through spirit. And they had other lovers. This is somebody that cheated on you constantly. Over and over. Without disregard. They didn't care. Long as they was getting out. The piece of the pie. Well, the whole pie for some of you guys. Okay. They didn't care about sabotaging you. They didn't care about that. They didn't care about doing none of this. None of this. They were very demanding control. They come through spirit. Had several lovers here. Yeah, it's back up on the day. And this person was unpredictable. Sometimes they loved you and sometimes they hated you. Sometimes you felt like you were walking on eggshells while you was in a relationship with this person. Yeah, but you gained some clarity. You gained some uh, perspective and some healing. Yeah, this person has plans to come in and take this good news away from you. Try to sabotage it. They plan to come travel towards you. Yeah, that's what they plan to do. Yeah, because they want to show off. This is a fucking, this is a uh, a big ass narc that wants to show off and prove themselves. They have a need to prove themselves that they can get you back. It says, <laughs> need to prove themselves insecure, exhibitist. They are show off. So this motherfucker is green too. Like, yeah, I bet you I can get her back. Or I can, I bet you I can get them back. Girl, boy, you can't get nobody back. Long as somebody has this, you can't get nobody back. You can't cloud nobody's judgment. They know the real you. They know who you are underneath, bitch. You are the devil. You'll never get this person back. You might as well to take your ass on and continue your plans on what you've been doing with your uncertain ass life. Take your raggedy ass off. Because you know show off over here. We know who you are. Yeah, you can live at a distance from this person. This person put distance between you and them. This person could have ghosted you. Okay? You left this person too. Some of you guys, you left. You left them. Okay? They didn't leave you. You left them. Okay? For some of you. And you did the right thing. It says, so far away physical and emotional see if you can rekindle the passion again this is what this person wants they wants to close the gap they want to close the distance between you and guys they want to come in and date you romance romanticize you so they can sabotage you okay this is what they want to do to stop your divine masculine coming in that is something that is already destined to happen for you and it is protected Somebody got the game messed up. Somebody got some false hope here because this shit is not going to happen. Come through spirit. Somebody really got the big head. This show off here. This player here. They, they can really take you down. <laughs> Already going through karma and shit. <laughs> you better sit your ass down. Somebody giving this person, somebody pumping this person's head up to get embarrassed. Okay? This gold digger. They could be a with a gold digger. <laughs> Somebody that also is pumping this person head like, yeah, you can get it. Yeah, you can get it. This person is for some of you. This 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 King of Cups in the reverse is a gold dig, a gold digger, and and this person burnt you. They've been burnt too by a gold digger. 
Could, you can look at it that way. Yeah, you know, anything's with this person. This cycle is over. With endings here. It's a wrap. I don't know why somebody keeps trying. It's over. Yeah. And you walk this journey alone. For some of you, this person is single now. They think they could come in and get you. Uh, because whoever they with, they broke up with a co uh, Who is this gold digger here? Hold on. Let me find out some information here. Who is this gold digger? Maybe they got they got burned by a gold digger. Now they looking back at you from the past with the six of cups. Here. Who is this gold digger here? Yeah, they're looking at the star. So this person is the gold digger. This is who wants to come back to get some money. The devil. Okay? This is the devil here. Yeah. That's unsuccessful. They don't have any abundance. They broke. So this is the gold digger. This is the male gigolo here. This is the opportunist that wants your money. They want you to invest back into their negative ass habits after they try to send dark magic your way. And it didn't work out because you're still, you're still st fated to have everything that God wants you to have after you left this person out in the cold. Yeah, your anthem coming in. This is what they want you to do to walk away from your divine counterpart. It'll be a fuck no. It'll be a cold day in hell. Come through spirit with the confirmation. I said that. Yeah. <laughs> you rest. You recovered. And you've healed away from this person. This this divine masculine going to come in healed. This is the only motherfucker that's not healed here. Yeah. They're not. They're not. At all. This person got their eye on you too. Your divine counterpart. Mm. This motherfucker's sexy. Whoever they is. This is who you need to be worried about. Yeah. This is who you need to be worried about. I told you they sexy and got a big ass dick. Okay? Whoever this is. You know I don't sugarcoat shit. Yeah. This is the gold digger here. This is who your ex got with. Queen of Pentacles that do magic. They thought they were going to have your destiny, child. These people could have been living off of your motherfucking money. Living off your energy here. Now shit done fell apart for their ass. That's that's another thing I'm getting. Shit is ending for these people. This Queen of Pentacles and this King of Cups that does black magic. They invest into it. They pay for it. Whatever they do here. They do it them damn selves. Whatever. Yeah. Because this person is promiscuous out here. Your, your divine counterpart is coming in, baby. And somebody trying to pump this person's head up to go towards you so they can get some money from you. This is who trying to pump their head up because they falling flat on their ass. Both of them is. So they trying to tag team you. Or this is this person he done broke up from because she was a dishonest. He got burnt by this bitch. Yeah. This person is in their dark side, shadow side, constantly. 24-7, seven, seven days a week because they the devil. And they got with a devil. So they met themselves in somebody else. And that's what the fuck they did. One more here, Spirit. <laughs> yeah. King of Wands. Fell right on top of the Queen of Pentacles. King of Cups slash King of Wands. Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. This is who we talking about. Woo. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. That's watching you. Pocket watching your shit. Watching you, bro. Man, take your raggedy ass on you and this hoe. Take both of y'all ass home. Because y'all ain't shit. Y'all just alike. He could have married this bitch for money. Now they both broke. <laughs> Tell us more, Spirit, about these hoes. Expose it. This land right on top of the what? Yeah. Boss daddy. Yeah, that's right. It says stable, rich, business owner. That's this king of pentacles. Emperor out here. Big dick energy. I told you they had a big dick. Whoever this is, they gonna dick your ass down. So be ready, cause I damn sure am. You better be ready for me. Period. <laughs> yeah, this person is haunted from the past. How they treated you with this motherfucker that he got played. He got burnt. Cause he chose other motherfucking lovers over you. You the emperor's out here, man. What the fuck he thought? <laughs> what? What else? 
Don't trust this motherfucker when he come in. Don't trust nothing he says. Absolutely nothing. This is what they're going through. Court, divorce, child support, immigration, lawyer, etc. Somebody is broke here. Somebody's going through some shit and they're a happiness hater. They hate your spirituality too. They they hate that you know their ass. Inside out. <laughs> yeah. Dodging bullets. You dodging these people. Tell us more of your spirit. One more. Yeah. Dust this shit off, Empress. Dust it off. This is a scum bucket. That's all this is. This motherfucker is a tyrant. A nagger. Somebody that lost control. That still think they got control. And still think they got it. Boy, if you don't go get your ass somewhere and sit down, you lint ball. You and this hoe. Take your regular ass on. Oh, I still got it. I can dig her down. I can have whatever I want. You ain't got shit. You barely got any money out here. What else? <laughs> yeah. Child services, I'm telling you. This person could have got... This person or this person, this queen of... Pentacles in the reverse, Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn here could have called child sources. Somebody could be losing their children. A lot of court shit going on with this person. Because a, a, a lot of abuse and neglect here. These could be child abusers. Tell you the truth. Yeah, third party is over with. He's breaking up with this bitch. Now he's looking back at you. Oh, I doubt it. <laughs> I doubt it. I doubt it. I seriously doubt that. You too busy winning over here, Empress. Yeah. Yeah. They are hunted. They having flashbacks of how they did you. How they paid. This could be this person who they was with, this dark ass witch here that was doing spell work on you. Okay? This person hates your power. They hate it. Yeah, this person ain't shit. Come through, Spirit. They ain't shit. Whew. Give me one more here, Spirit, and we're going to close it out. Overall energy here, Spirit. Whew. Yep. A lot of drugs habits, bad habits, drugs, addictions, trickery, toxic city. Toxic. This is toxic. It's a no. Absolutely not. On the bottom of the deck. Don't trust it. Ignore this person. Come through, Spirit. They have somebody for you, my love. Okay? I hope this resonates with some of you guys. I hope it gives you the clear and concise answer that you need. If this person has plans to travel, turn that ass around. Don't even answer your door. Okay? And that's just period. For anybody that you haven't talked to in years, they coming back with a hidden agenda. They coming back with lies and deception underneath that motherfucker and behind that smile. Okay? I love you guys. Y'all stay safe. Take care. Mwah. Until next time. Bye. <laughs>